here, this young lady. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? How's your trip? So far, so good. Awesome. This is the best part. Yeah? <laughs> good. My name is Heba, right? Hi. Hi. Everybody's looking at me. Look, look at him, not me. <laughs> right. So I want to become a politician slash a diplomat, right? Cool. And so, you know, you may think this is crazy, but I also do want to change the world in a positive Great. way. Good. So back at Harvard, I was, you know, telling my, a friend of mine my, my passions and what I want to do. And so I'm did really... Did you say Harvard? No, it was an event. Oh. I, I went to a prison Jordan there. <laughs> yes, Harvard, Boston. <laughs> So I was, uh, I was telling a friend of mine about like, you know, I want to put my interests into politics and diplomacy and I want to try to benefit my society and the world as well. So he was like, um, you have to be corrupted to get to that point, to reach, to have power, you have to be corrupted. I hope we don't have any politicians in the room, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> So, I, I understand the idiom that right. power can corrupt. I and understand then, the idiom. And it and can. Then, and I'm, I'm looking at a lot of leaders today in the world, and some of them are fueled by hatred, mm -hmm. by greed, by making us hate each other, by making us think yeah. that, hey, yeah. I'm from this country, I'm better than you. Yeah. And it's working so far so great for them. Yeah, there's, right? a, there's a book called uh, The Denial of Death, written by a psychologist called Ernest Becker. And there's a theory that came out of that book called Terror Management Theory okay. that says that fear of death can inform our behavior in socially acceptable ways and in socially destructive ways. And the us versus them that emerges so much, that, that tribalism or hyper-nationalism, like what we're seeing in America, for example, that fear of the other, it actually comes from a psychological fear of mortality. And so... Uh, politicians that feed that fear, whether they're aware of it or not, are exploiting a, 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 a problem that human beings have. Like they're exploiting a weakness that we have. Fear sometimes results in us becoming bullies, you know, and then we attach ourselves mm -hmm. to systems of dominating the other because it makes us feel temporarily immortal. So just as a side note, it's a very interesting book into the psychology of the human condition that would make you understand the formula used by certainly politicians in the U.S. right now, to excite their base into that hatred fervor that, that they foam at the mouth practically, you know, that because they feel enlarged by bullying the other, and it's a horrible thing, so. Did someone write the name of the book? Cause Denial of Death by Ernest okay. Becker. Okay. Right. So after I thought about it, okay. I'm like, it's kind of true. In order for you to reach to the top of the pyramid, you, you do have to be a bit corrupted. And I do not want that at all. Yeah. Like, so I, I was telling also my dad, he was like, I guess you have to find a different passion. Mm -hmm. I'm like, no, I'm not going to do that. So how do I get to where I want? Yeah. Instead of like, and, and how with about my dis pure disrupting politics? I think so. <laughs> Disrupt it. I how? think, it, well, information technologies, you know, maybe, maybe it's through an app that changes the nature of voter participation. I mean, I don't understand why people can't thumbprint ID on their phone to vote on issues or vote for their politics. I mean, I just, you know, to disrupt, I mean, just disrupt the industry. I mean, politics is just another industry. Like, maybe it needs to be disrupted. Maybe it needs a new generation of thinkers and doers that want to rebuild the system from the ground up. How do Thank we create you. that when Thank the majority you. are <laughs> I think we're good. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you Thanks. all for coming. I wish we could stay here all night. I wish we could take all your answers, but um, thank you Jason guys. You guys are beautiful people. Limit. I love you. you. Thank you. Thank you.